Hey there, it's Tiffany over at Creative Home Stagers, and I am in my little sewing corner here. Um, wanted to share one of the things that I've been doing since we've been at home, and that would be making face masks. So I've been making face masks for people in my neighborhood, some of the older people. Um, I donated about 50 of them to um, uh, a <clears throat> local cause. I don't know if they're sending all of them out to the hospitals or they're just sending them out to whoever needs them first and whatever's left over, but I made about 50 for them. And then I'm just kind of giving them to people who need them around the neighborhood or if anybody I know um, knows someone who needs them, I've been making them. So I just made four today and I'm going to send them out. And um, that's what I've been doing, at least one of the many crazy things I've been doing as we all kind of stay at home and stay safe. I have my good old Bessie here and she's been really, really working hard. I just broke a needle. I was making a mask um, out of one of my favorite fabrics. I ordered the sample from Jeffrey Allen Marks. Um, he is a designer in California. I kind of love, love, love him. And um, I ran out of fabric and I ordered his memo as a potential window treatment for a laundry room. And um, he, this fabric keeps breaking my needle. So I think it's too, too heavy to make a mask out of. But anyway, thank you to Kravit. Thank you, Jeffrey Allen Marks. I'm gonna, I may have to hand sew the rest of it <laughs> to finish it, but um, it's still a contender for the laundry room. I love, love, love you. And um, anyway, that's it. That's all I have to say about masks. 